Holy crap, that's a lot of zombies. Why? I'm gonna have to look back in the recordings to find out what the heck it was that I was doing. Because I don't remember what I was doing, because it's been four months since I've recorded an episode for this series, so... Oh dear. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna have to deal with this problem, and... Ah, this is- this is a lot of zombies. It's wrecking my sword, too. Okay, so I've been here for a while just repeatedly killing zombies, and... It's- it's gonna destroy my sword. And I really don't want to destroy my sword, so I think I'm just gonna get out of here. Like, I- I think it would be a good idea for me to abandon this dungeon for the time being and come back to it... ...in a later episode. <laughs> um... I hope, at this point, I've probably told you guys that I'm splitting the season in half, so... I'm, yeah, I think I know what I- yeah, I'm going to... ...come back to this <laughs> in the second half of season two, because this is way more zombies than I want to deal with. This is way more than I want to deal with. Um, so... But I want the experience, though, because I really need it. Um, it's- it's important. Whoa, that's a lot of skeletons. Uh... Heh <laughs> heh. <laughs> oh, this is just great, isn't it? Oh god, and there's a little mini zombie bastard down there, too. God, I hate mini zombies. Does anyone like mini zombies? I don't know anybody who likes mini- I, uh, what, what? Why is- Oh god, I can't see what I'm doing because of the experience. Um, everybody needs to die. Is everybody dead now? I think everybody's dead now. At least most of the things are dead now. So can I have the rest of this experience, please, so it can just be like a horrifying- Oh god, no, 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 freaking mini-zombie, get away from me. They're always harder to kill, too, than the big ones. The big ones are easier, at least, well, sort of. So you die, and all of you are gonna die, alright? You're gonna die in flaming death, and you're gonna get away from me, and I'm gonna get out of here. Oh god, there's another one, why? Why do- why did I subject myself to this? Like, what was going through my head four months ago that made me think it was a good idea to subject myself to this? Anyways, so I want to get out of here. This is a cave. Alright. That's fine. But anyways, um... So, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? So I finally got out. <laughs> And, um, now, I, now I'm totally disoriented. This, this looks good, though. No more of that, though. <laughs> um, for the time being. Uh, yeah, this is the way that we want to go, because of that weirdly shaped mountain. That's the only way that I know where I'm going, is when I can see this weirdly shaped mountain in this world. Um, so I'm going to go home and I'm going to do stuff. I, I gotta repair my sword. Like, that's, that's a major priority. And, um, I gotta repair my pickaxe, too. I mean, my pickaxe isn't, like, terribly worn down, but it's worn down enough where it should be repaired. But my sword is suffering. It's really suffering. So, yeah, this is great. Just, like, a long run home. You know, I should have brought Dragon with me and, like, parked him outside. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. Park my horse outside. Like, who par- like, can you imagine somebody parallel parking with a horse? That'd be pretty hilarious. But anyways, I should have parked him outside and then just, like, rode home with him. Although I kind of would have felt bad because of just leaving him there tied to a fence post. That's a mean thing to do. I'd never do that to Dragon. That's a big hole. That must have been some serious creepage. Um... So, finally home. I know that I don't have the texture pack on, by the way, and I don't have the texture pack on because it needs to be updated. So, yeah, and I might have turned it off because I think everything in the dungeon was lagging when I was in there. I don't really remember. It's been like four months. Hey, I wonder. Oh my god, I have like a un unintended zombie, or mob spawner. Mob grinder. <laughs> she threw it at the zombie, and I think it just hit the zombie. <laughs> um, cause that like 
fire at the witch, please? That'd be, that'd be nice. Good, I got it. Great. Awesome. What'd you give me? You gave me a bottle. Thank you. Goodbye, zombie flesh. I don't need any of that. So, uh, yeah, back to business. Oh my god, that's so many levels. That is so many levels. Um... It needs to be done, though. So... Yep. Too expensive. Never mind. Is it possible that I can... Nope. Nope. I can't do the switcheroo trick. <sighs> so I, I completely forgot. I was told a long time ago by a very close friend of mine... You see her comments on my channel all the time, Anani Pig, to name the donkey Sancho. And I have been neglecting to do that for a very long time. So now I'm going to finally name Sancho. Here you go, Christina. See this? I'm about to name Sancho. This is what you've been waiting for, and eventually, when I can figure out why these stupid sheep won't grow back their will, will, wool, I will um, make the purple octopus. So there we go. We've got Sancho. Yay, we've got a Sancho. You have, I have stuff in his inventory. <laughs> I forgot that was there. I'll have to get that out someday. Um, but yeah, maybe we'll actually like, bring Sancho somewhere someday. Ah, there we go. So I've been doing like all kinds of stuff and things. And I'm not sure why I'm in F5 mode right now. I don't think I intended to do that. But anyways, so yeah, I've been doing, like, stuff. And I'm thinking what I'm going to do right now is go into the nether. Because of reasons known as getting wither skulls. God, that painting looks absolutely horrible sitting above my bed. Um, but one thing that I want to do first um, is name my bow. Because I haven't done that. So, I used to have a bow named Windbreaker in, like, another survival world that I was playing in. But I don't like that name for some reason for a bow. I don't know why. I just don't like that name. So, I'm thinking... I'm not going to ask you guys to name it. But what the hell do I want to name this bow? Mm. I don't think, yeah, Will O Wisp is it's it's a little fire spirit thing. I think I'm I'm just not gonna do that. I um I can't get around the fence post. Oh God! <laughs> just so you guys know, it's like two two ten in the morning right now. When it's late at night and it's like this. I, I have a very unique sense of humor. I'm so sorry, everybody. <laughs> I don't know what you're expecting. Death to you, cube squid, and everything that you stand for. Don't you fire that crap at me. I said death to you, gosh darn it. You will die. You will die a death only fit for cube squids. Yeah, so anyways, I, I've been here for like five minutes. And this is what I was greeted with. Finally, you're dead. Now you'll stop firing things at me and then I can go do what I want to do, which was collect wither skulls and kill these guys too, because death to you, you black skeleton creatures with swords. All of you must die. Is it kind of weird that, like, if you look at three um, wither skeletons from a distance, they kind of look like Cerberus? If you don't know what Cerberus is, then that made, like, no sense whatsoever. But anyways, um, yeah. Did you drop anything? No, of course not. Why would they ever drop a wither skull? Like, that's ever gonna happen. Oh my god, with the cube squids! Jesus Christ! No, die, cube squid, die. Ooh, cool. I was expecting to do that. Hey, everybody, how's it going? And...
and you're gonna die first because you'll fire things at me when I try to kill the other things and then I'll get withered. I don't really want to be withered right now, so... Oh, there's two of them. Oh, that's fantastic. Can I please get a wither skull out of this? Because I'd like to get a wither skull out of this. That'd be really nice if I could get a wither skull out of this, because if I could get a wither skull, then, you know, we can fight the wither and all that good stuff. Because who doesn't want to fight the wither? I'd like to fight the wither. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about right now. <laughs> don't you wither me? Okay, so anyways, um, I'm not kidding with you guys with the way that I am. It's like, it's it's about 2.45 right now, just to give you guys a sense of how long I've been here. Um, and I don't know why I'm keeping track of the time. Maybe I could just, it can just give you guys a sense of, oh. Well then, <laughs> the poor guy, he was just like, No! Don't leave me! I just wanted to be friends! But anyways, um... So... I want... Is that... Am I just, like, being stupidly hopeful, or is there really something that I could use down there? Let me just go down there really quick and get whatever might be there, because... Nope, it was a piece of coal. It's always a piece of coal. It's always a piece of coal. Stupid coal. Coal, I hate you. I hate everything about you and your coalness. You're so coaly. <sighs> Onward we go. So, yeah, no no luck with a wither skull. Just, just no luck. Would have been nice, but nope. No wither skull. So sad. Is it raining? No, it's not. Well, I, oh, it's raining in a different biome. I forgot about that, that it doesn't, like, rain in a savanna biome, but it behaves like it's raining when the cloud, when the sky gets all dark. It actually looks really nice, and I like the color of the sky when it's, like, about to rain, and it gets just, like, that nice gray color. Especially, like, right in the middle of summer when the leaves are, like, a super bright green. That's really nice. Um... Can I sleep right now? No, I cannot. Nope, it's definitely not nighttime. It felt like it was nighttime, though. But it's it's not nighttime. The game is toying with me. But it really feels like nighttime. Toggle downfall. Okay, and can I have my clouds back, please? Why are my clouds off? Fan I, I like fancy clouds, because clouds should always be fancy. There's, there's no reason not to have fancy clouds. Um, unless you have a really terrible um, processor, then it makes sense not to have fancy clouds. Um, I also recommend that you, if you do have a terrible processor, you should probably upgrade. Yeah, like I'm totally advising everybody on their computer needs right now, which is not the point of this episode. This, the point of this episode was to try to get closer to fighting the wither. Trying to get closer. Obviously not succeeding, but get it closer... I guess. I think what I'll do is um, deal with my inventory and, you know, I, I got withered like three times, so I will um, throw those away. Okay, nine times three is 27. Is it 27? Yes, it is. It is 27. Which means that, um, yeah, I'm throwing out 27 diamonds. I'm really glad that I switched to the, uh, throw it out the block of diamond rather than the individual diamonds. Is there anybody in here? Yes, there is someone in here. Beat your fate, zombie. No, <sighs> I always do that. Stupid squirrel wheel. Anyways, um... I don't remember what I was talking about. Oh yeah, yeah, I just think it's so much better to throw out the, uh, diamond cubes than to throw out the, um, individual diamonds, because I have way too many diamonds, let's face it. I could make a whole diamond palace if I wanted to. I'm not going to, but I could if I wanted to. So, let me just toss these diamonds into here. Goodbye, diamonds. It was so nice knowing you. You served your purpose of sitting in my inventory. Um, there. 
so goodbye diamonds. Ah, uh, is that horrible psh noise? It's so sad. But, you know, I haven't, like, actually looked at the landscape in a long time, and I know that's kind of weird to, like, just look at the landscape, but... It looks really nice in the default texture pack, um, especially with, like, a savanna biome up against the Amaza. It's just really nice and colorful, and that, like, bright orange and everything. I love it. So anyways, I want to thank you guys very much for watching, and hopefully in the next episode we will fight the wither, because that'd be fantastic. Because um, I'd like to move on from this challenge. So anyways, I want to thank you guys very much for watching. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like, and share this video with your friends so that they can know about the series and they can watch it and participate and all kinds of good stuff. So again, thank you guys, and I will see you in the next episode. Toodles!